guys and welcome back to my channel. It is currently Sunday, which is why I'm up so early. I'm getting ready for church, but I wanted to film a little shop with me. You know me, you know that I'm not a shopper. Like, I don't like malls really. Um, I'm normally just the type of like, oh, I need this one specific book. Let me go in Barnes and Noble and I'll look around a little bit. Like that kind of shopper. But lately I've been in the mood to kind of shop around. So after church, I'm gonna head to our closest city, I guess, um, and shop. It's kind of a outdoor shopping center. So I think I'm gonna plan on going to like Aerie, Barnes, maybe Victoria's Secret, I have a coupon probably Ulta. We'll see. And I might go to a place my mom found to get something to go right here. Because as you can see, my room is very cute, but it's not finished how I wanted it to. Um, if you guys don't know, I just came home from college and I'm trying to get my room exactly how I want it. And I'm going for neutrals, kind of creams, beige, and then the greenery with the plants. But yeah, this is, I've had this for years, that hand sign. So I'm going to see if I can find something to go there. May or may not be successful. Guys, let me know if I'm the only one who matches their perfume to their outfit. Like, if I'm wearing a cute, cozy little moment, then I'll go for a, like, vanilla or if I'm wearing like something really girly, I'll go for something more fruity. But since it's church, I think I'm gonna wear actual perfume. I got this one for Christmas and it's the Pink Cloud and it smells really good. It smells really, really similar to the Blue Cloud, but it's a little more fruity, if that makes sense. I'm kind of conflicted as to which bag to take. Because this one's definitely more put together than this. But I think I'm going to bring this one. Because if I'm going shopping afterwards, I'm going to need to pack more things with me. So, tote bag it is. looking for anything specific but maybe a little set I saw a girl on Instagram post a reel with a really cute cozy looking set so we'll see these are really cute These little bodysuits are so cute. They're like skims dupes. They're the smoothies. No shirt for self. This is so cute and soft. These are also really, really cute. I like this tan color. It's kind of a pinky tan. I saw these on their Instagram. They're cropped little sweaters. So these are the little sets that I was talking about, the wrap sets. I got the brown to try on, but we'll see. If it doesn't fit, I may have to order it. These are so extremely soft. I really want to try this black and white one on. 
Hey guys. So, these are the things I got to try on. I got the alumni sweatshirt. Oops. Um, the brown set. This black and white shirt. And then this black and white sweater. Okay, so this is the alumni sweatshirt. And it's cute, but not my favorite. I don't think it's worth the price. <laughs> I'm obsessed with this one. This one is an absolute winner. It's super soft. So this set is super cute. The cargo sweatpants. I think that I would need a bigger top though. I would obviously have to wear a tank top under here. A little like sports bra. Um, and I might need a smaller in these. That's always the thing about shopping in person is like you can't get the exact sizes because that's like all they have. But I think I'm definitely going to order this online. So I think it's cute. There's something so nostalgic about coming in pink. Because like ninth grade, this is all I wore. I still wear the, where is it, warm and cozy. But yeah, I'm so nostalgic coming in here. So the only reason I really came in here is because I had a coupon for two free pairs of panties with any purchase. So I'm just going to buy like a lip gloss or something and see if that works. So I'm going into Barnes & Noble now. It's so freezing cold outside, but I'm so excited. I normally bounce back and forth between a romance and a thriller. So right now I'm looking for a mystery thriller book. So we'll see what we can find. This was one of the absolute best books I read in 2023. And I read her other book on the back and it was really good too, but nowhere near as good as this one. Okay, so these are the three I'm choosing from. We have Silent Patient, which a lot of my friends have recommended this, but the plot doesn't seem to draw me in, you know? And then this one's brand new and it's part of the Reese's book club and I normally love whatever she recommends. Um, it's called First Sly Wins. But this one, I've never heard of this one, but I think I'm gonna buy this one. It's called What the Neighbors Saw. It looks like a quick read. So, I think I'm gonna go with this one. You know I couldn't come in here and not come to the Harry Potter section. The fifth year is the only Jim K illustrated version I don't have. This one is, in fact, tore up. But, yeah. The Thestrals in this book that I've seen are so pretty. Oh. Is he not the cutest little Dobby you've ever seen? I should have took you guys in this really cute little toy store down here. They have a humongous jelly cat collection. But I know if I go in there, I'll buy one. And I don't need another one. So, yeah. So, I went and chopped. And I've never been in there before. But I saw it on the list of restaurants here. And look at this little wrap. I mean, it's kind of big. It's not little. But I got the kale Caesar wrap with the creamy Caesar sauce. So I'm going to try this and see how it is. That bite was pretty much bread, but 10 out of 10, I recommend. I guess I'll go in order of which store I went in, but from Airy, sadly, the set was not in my size in the store, and it's something that they're doing away with, so they're not getting more of them, so they're not on sale in my size online either, which is really sad, but what can you do? I did get this really cute sweater. It's just black with white stripes 
and it's super soft and I can wear those with jeans or leggings if you want to go with black on black but yeah I think this is really cute and it was on sale so and like I said I went to Victoria's Secret and the only reason I went there is because I got a coupon in the mail yesterday for two free pairs of panties if I bought something so I got a lip gloss and it looks really cute on and it smells good it is the honey shine flavored lip gloss I guess that why it tastes good too yeah so I got that I got my two free pairs of underwear I got this green pair it says pink they're really cute and these pink sparkly pair they're seamless yeah and the total came to $32 which only had to pay the $9 for the lip gloss so that's a steal and then last but certainly not least Barnes & Noble I got this one and it's what the neighbors saw by Melissa I don't know how to say that but yeah it's a mystery thriller and basically her and her husband move into a new home in Cape Cod and one of their neighbors ends up dead so yeah I don't know if it's gonna be like a whodunit or what kind of book but I'm excited it seems like it's gonna be a little quick read so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you next week bye